Hello students, how are you all? Hope you all are fine. In the last session, we had completed with the explanation of the poem. Today, we are going to begin with the next topic, that is the next chapter. Kindly open your textbook, page number 6. Children, can you see what is this? Okay, as the topic suggests, a synopsis. Now, what do you mean by synopsis? Now, synopsis means a brief summary or outline. Yes, so today our topic is a synopsis, the Swiss family Robinson. In this synopsis, it is a well-known adventure novel by Yuan David Weiss. The novel had been enjoyed by people for more than 200 years ago. So let's see what the author has written in this adventurous novel. The Swiss family Robinson is a well-known adventure novel that people of many countries have enjoyed for more than 200 years. How many years ago? 200 years they are enjoying the novel. It has also been made into graphic novels and films. That means using this story they have made uh, the graphic novels and even some movies are being made based on this. The novel written by Swiss clergyman. Clergyman means what? Priest. Yuan David West is not an adventure. It aims at teaching young people values like self-reliance, determination, love for your family, cooperation and prudent use of resources. What do you mean prudent? Wise use of resources. It is also good lesson relevant in natural science, good husbandry and even mathematics. Now as we learn the subjects, now what is the use of subjects? So that the knowledge can be applied somewhere. For example, uh, your maths, your mathematics. The addition, when you go out in a shop or in the market, you go and buy something, some vegetables. At that time, you don't use a calculator, but you add mentally. That means whatever you had learned as a subject, there you apply it and then you use it. Some elements of the novel do stretch reality to a certain extent, but we must consider it as a work of fiction and not a fact file. Now, in this novel, though, though it is a, a fiction, in reality many things don't happen often as such. Now, there is a difference between the word fiction and a fact file. Now, in a fiction means what? When uh, when the writer writes anything he wishes, he exaggerates and stretches the reality. But fact file is what? Actually, the fact which has been happened. So, the story or adventure story is not a fact file. It is a work of fiction. Given below is a synopsis, an outline of its basic story. William, Elizabeth and their children had been travelling in a ship when the ship was caught in a great storm. The other passengers evacuated. Evacuated means what? Left the ship to save themselves. Everybody left but William and his family including the young children Fritz, Ernest, Jack, Franz were left alone to survive left to survive alone. That means four children and the parents, that is William and the Elizabeth. Six were their total. They weathered 
the great storm waiting in the ship's hold the ship survived the night and the family found themselves within sight of a tropical desert island the next morning they decided to get into the island they could see beyond the reef now what do you mean by reef reef is a rocks or sand that is close to the surface when we reach to the close when we reach to the surface of the sea now we find what we find rocks and uh, the sand so they could see it with much effort they constructed a vessel out of tubs now what do you mean by vessel it is not vessel in which we eat the vessel is no vessel means a boat here it is boat after they filled the tubs with the food and ammunition and all other articles of value they could safely carry they rowed towards the island two dogs from the ship named turk and juno turk and juno who are they they are the two dogs swam beside them the ship's cargo of livestock now what do you mean by livestock now the farm animals and birds like cows pigs chickens that are kept and used by the people na they are known as livestock guns and powder carpentry tools these are chisel and all these are known as carpentry tools books and a this amble this amble pinnacle this amble pinnacle and provisions had also survived now this amble means what they are been taken apart and pinnace means what small boat attached to the ship see when you go na to cruise when you travel by cruise and all na where there are uh, huge ships are there along with it there are small small boats are being kept that in in case of emergency they could be helpful so pinnace means a small boat attached to the ship over the next few days William that is the father of the four attached the floatable old kegs to one another and built a bow that curved around them now what is the kegs kegs are the barrels in the barrels the family had landed successfully on the island they set up a tent and softened the floor with armloads of grass they cut and spread to serve as a bed now now here definitely they did not have any beds so they used the grass as a bed they came to a grove of trees there were many trees were there one tree grew what looked like girls on it okay it was a huge tree and then what happened tree trunk the father told fritz the girls would make a excellent bowls and spoons and they cut them into various utensils so with the help of with that they made what they made bowls and spoons after some day elizabeth informed william that she wanted the family to move to a safer place the current camp was not only exposed but also very dry and hot where they were staying it was very dry and hot if they built a house up in one of the large trees uh, they could be safe from jackals the uh, animals which are harmful to the human beings she described a perfect tree for the project one whose trunk was nearly 40 feet in diameter in a circle we have a radius diameter so 40 feet uh nearly it was the diameter was the branches were very long and extended straight out from the trunk making them perfect platforms for a structure later when determining the height of the lowest branches the father taught the boys geometry and how to use triangles to measure big objects now here the father guided those boys that means uh, his children about the geometry how the geometry is useful here 
how to use triangles to measure the objects he measured a defined distance from trunk then he calculated angles using several measured rods determining that the lowest branch was 30 feet of the ground what he gave the correlation that the lowest branch was 30 feet off from the ground so just imagine how big the tree how tall the tree was the men knotted a rope at certain intervals and attached pieces of bamboo in each knot they uh, thus they created their ladder and then they with the help of that they created a ladder by using uh, a piece of bamboo and then tying knots further re- father returned to the beach and collected driftwood thinking it would be perfect to build a sledge now he was thinking to build a sledge driftwood means the pieces of the wood that are floating on the water so father returned to beach so that he could collect some drift wood that is the pieces of wood that were floating on the water so that he could make a perfect sledge a sledge is a sort of vehicle on uh, used on runners used to travel for traveling over the snow and ice okay uh, you won't be able to see the sledges here but you find the sledges where there is a snow or ice so runners means what it is a long strips on which the uh, something slides okay you, you know need to just uh, like a wheel but it slides on its own later they used it to transport materials meanwhile elizabeth announced that the garden she had been tending was producing healthy plants tending taking care of those who are producing healthy plants corn melons pumpkins and cucumbers were already growing that means these vegetables were already growing the next day only the father and the fritz traveled to the woods exploring and finding such exotic plants as one with a waxy fruit see on the fruit na some of the fruits have wax on them from which the candles could be made fritz discovered a tree exuding that is giving out a rubbery sap sap is what uh, a plant from which na if you break the stem na uh, you find that the some sticky thing is coming out that is known as a rubbery sap from which his father claimed that they could make boots that is from that rubber they made boots thinking ahead of the next winter father decided to create a place safe from the elements a strong storage spot to protect themselves and their belongings fritz came up with a idea of a cave so he suggested that why not uh, we go and stay in the cave or we or we uh, for they having the warmth we go and stay in cave not finding one they thought of carving out their own cave in the rock now cave was not there was no ready made cave available there so they thought carving a cave from the rock abutting their camping site on the smooth face of the rock father marked the dimensions father gave the markings for an opening and they picked away at a hard surface with their axes axes that means when you want to cut numb the rocks axes chisels hammers shovels shovels uh, they are being used to remove remove na whatever is a thrash or uh, especially where the snow is there so shoveling is being done to remove the snow and all hammers you all know chisel uh, so the uh, pointed like thing so that uh, to beat or to carve or something these all instruments are being used over the next several days the family cut windows in the rocks to allow for the cross currents cross currents the cross ventilation should be there na every house or every home has na cross ventilation so for the cross currents of the air and for sunlight to enter the cave when they had finished they had four rooms 
complete with a fireplace they now had a new winter home so we can see here that with the hard work they were able to make uh, the key for themselves so that their winter is safe and they had made with the four rooms and even there was a fireplace along with it so such a hard work was being there so i hope you all understood the extract now assignment for the day will be the meanings are given you are supposed to write down in your english notebook and the summary you are going to write down in your own words thank you